Hello friends. Let us see how to use Google Forms. Google Forms is a very good option for everyone to get the feedback from your customer or maybe from the students when you have explained about the chapter. So you can see that I have started Google Forms in that. I have already made some of the forms. I will go with that. But yes, you have to go with the new form. As you will click on new form, you will get the uh, new form over there. I will show my form which I have already created. Uh, let us not waste our time. Yes, you can see here the name of the quiz I have given. With that, uh, the questions, some of the questions I have given. First, you have to go for the setting before starting the forms. Here, you have to set that make this a quiz. So, yes, you have to make it active. Uh, it is like this first of all but you will make it active this one then click on presentation on that you want to see the progress bar of the students then you can go to the progress bar yes and then next to that is uh, limit the response of the people right like there are many people from that one one man one person is uh, se sending the response again and again again and again so instead of that you want to limit the response of a person then you can do it with the help of limit limit to one response you want to see the summary of the chat yes you can see it click on save as you have saved it now you can go with the questions here there are many options for setting the questions there are many many options short answers paragraph multiple choice wh whichever you like it that you can do but i will go with multiple choice because i want to set the points for it so i want to give the marks for it right so if i want to set a quiz in which i want to set the marks i can go with it i will go to the answer key in that set the point and with that i will select the default answer means default answer means the correct answer and click on done as i've completed now here you can see required option required option is to uh, make it compulsory for a person to attempt that question and this is to delete the question okay now when you have completed you will go with the response in response you will make it uh, off that thing see this is on and this one is off so you will off this response why because when you will set the quiz when, when you will start the quiz at that time only it will be activated next here it is for send option when you will click on send there are three uh, types of options send via so here via the gmail or email whatever the email you are having by that you want to send the link or you want to send the link by the uh, whatsapp or any other uh, media then you have to click on copy from here you can see the copy option you will copy and paste it in whatsapp or whatever the medium you are going to uh, set it then as you have done you know that uh, everything is done and by default it will save by itself you can see your all changes are saved in your drive so it will be saved in your google drive you can uh, create your own folder like according to the standard or according to the person or categories you can uh, create a folder now i have done it i will show you some of the forms which i have already created here you can see general computer quiz and then uh, quiz for standard eight and worksheets you can also create the worksheets you can give the assignments to the students hope you all like it and uh, please subscribe my channel.